all right making a video so basically as you can see man I'm outside and it's crazy cause like I said about the home I'm living at right now man it's haunted meaning you wake up, you feel, you know, a bunch of demonic cursed energy. And it's a setup to try to, you know, like, to kill you off. Like, it's like they literally targeting you to get you to want to kill yourself. Put you on medication. You, you start being depressed. You start because now looking at it like this, man, the energy is terrible. Like. Having to be around this cursed energy isn't, isn't good. Isn't good to be around this cursed energy. So, you gotta find some way to to work with it here, go through the process of, you know, finally being able to leave uh, and get out and do it for yourself. But even then, there's a hold up with like how the freedom is because gotta say this is about taking freedom this is all about me trying to take my freedom and for there to be a bunch of demonic weird energy attacking me like depression energy energy like I mean so like how real supernatural is when you when you know like this full of people and there's no structure there's no real love going on there's, you, you're not supposed to live with people that that you have no relationship with. You're not supposed to just live with a bunch of people that, you know, there, there's no connection with them. You're not supposed to. The home is supposed to be structurized and it's supposed to have, you know, order in it. It's supposed to have... And that's what I was saying. Like, the fact there's no order in these in these homes down here on this earth, when you're born with your family, there's no order... It's a setup to a lot of devil to come in your life and to try to wipe you out. And that's what I view it as the devil trying to wipe me out. This nigga want me dead or some shit. And I've never felt the most depression energy my whole life than being in this home, man. Like, I never felt the most lonely than being in this home. And it's just God showing me different sides of the world, how the world operates. He's showing me different mentals, different ways the devil uses to attack people. And because we still live in a supernatural, like this is <laughs> this is supernatural that we <laughs> that we living in. And it's real, it's real shit though, like you gotta be more careful like with how the devil attacks people like this. And this is just if you're going if this is for like people like you depressed, you're going through shit. I'm telling you, bro, it's the devil. This is how the demonic spirits work. It's like your, your place is haunted. There's not liveliness, and you gotta have some type of way to, you know, be around something lively and have real communication, have real relationship, and you need, you need a relationship. You need a friendship. You ultimately, and unfortunately, I don't have no friend. I don't have no relationship. You know, it's it all goes back to the Adam and Eve curse. Adam and Eve. You know, Adam. God gave Adam Eve because Adam was lonely, you know. It even said that that it's not good for men to be alone. So, but that's basically what it is, you know, is we're living in this Adam and Eve cursed where relationships is fucked, communication is fucked. For me, I have the lonely curse on my life. I have the financial curse on my life right now. And I'm supposed to get SSDI here soon to to get the financial curse somewhere off my life so that should help and then I can have more leverage to do what I want supposedly so it's just it's a really slow process man and you know you don't you don't feel loved you don't feel cared for you, you need some type of love you need some type of care you need some type of intimacy mainly with like a woman like because that's what men were created to be with a woman. Like that's that's what it is. It's some real shit though that that don't get discussed because 
this world just too demonized, man. They're not gonna teach you this shit in school. They're not gonna tell you that that's that stuff like like bluntly like a, that's the devil and everything. No, you know a lot of people, you know, they they afraid to, t to tell you all this stuff because it's too much. It's too much to release. It's too much, and you know. Battle Creek, Michigan is obviously haunted or some shit because it's just this this cursed spirit you can feel and nobody nobody joins together to to understand and to to help each other out and get get each other what they need and ultimately that's just the way it is you know it's like we need more people ready for the community to stick up and and go against these demonic forces because there's too much demonic forces around we gotta fight these amount of forces. If I'm coming here telling people, if I'm over here on YouTube saying that, or, or, or to my community, telling my community, hey, you know, you should listen to me. And they don't listen to me about about pertaining to topics like this. It's crazy because it's their fault. The blood is on their hands because they did nothing. They just did absolutely nothing. And I get everybody have their own life. They have, they, they have to work. They have to go to school. They have to and, and, and that's that's the whole setup too. It's set up like that, and it's just it needs to be more. It, it's just we're not in natural human habitation. This is not human habitation. You gotta understand the whole Adam and Eve curse and how that works. So it's about trying to do something because you know we're not in the natural human habitation. So yeah, so basically that's what I wanted to say in this video about the demonic spirit attacking me. Peace.